just now five fifteen. I think I got to go to work today. Yeah, today day three vlog. You wanna know what the number flies pounds you are doing three. That means day three. Should I add day three? Flies a day zero three. Do you want to know how many days to find that? Anyway, my name is Hill and I'm currently doing daily vloggy right now. So, um, I need coffee.
I know I haven't vlogged in a long time. Or went live. Some of you guys noticed that I took down my YouTube channel for the last two weeks. I took it down because I just, I needed to back off of social media for a while. I took down my Facebook and everything too. But last night I put up my YouTube channel. I um, mean, I have to work on it again tonight to organize it how I want. Um, this week's pretty busy for me. My uncle passed away. He was battling cancer on and off for the last 10 years. Um, and he lost his battle with cancer. Uh, it's my mom's brother. Anyways, so that funeral is this Saturday. Nine in the morning, so we have to leave about 8.15. So tomorrow I have to go shopping for a funeral clothes for me and Connor because we don't have any. And then I have to go to the car wash and vacuum out my car because there's a lot of dog hair everywhere. That's not fun to have dog hair on your nice funeral clothes. Then I have to go get an oil filter and get more oil and do an oil change on my car tomorrow. I have to clean the house. Today I'm doing errands. Went to Walgreens and take a medicine. Now I'm going to another store because we need more laundry soap, paper towel, all that shit for the house. And, uh, am I doing today? I was supposed to meet Harold at Taco Bell before he goes to his other job, but he went to a different Taco Bell and I went to a different Taco Bell. Fuck it. So now, now I'm doing my errands. So I'm kind of excited. I mean, I'm not excited, but I'm happy because for the funeral this Saturday, you guys know my parents are deaf. And so are me and Harold. So I was able to secure an interpreter for the funeral. So that's nice because most of the time when we go to funerals, there's no interpreter. So I'm grateful for that. Um, what else do I need to update you guys on? This Friday, me, Harold, and Carter are going to... Uh, We're going to the county fair. I'm excited for that. Thanks to my friend Shorty, Amber. She's going to watch Maya for us so we can go. Because we can't really do anything together. Because Maya can't stay home. You guys know she has really bad separation and anxiety. So it's always me and Carter or me and Harold. If not all three of us. Never. So I'm looking forward to finally having a day with both of my family. So I'm looking forward to that. And then my friend, my other friend Kayla will come Friday night, meet us at the fair, and then sleep over because she's going to watch Maya for me Saturday because of the funeral. I have really fucking awesome friends. I love, love, love my friends so much. They mean a lot to me, for sure. So yeah, um, that's my week, really. Busy today, tomorrow, Friday, wait, tomorrow, Wednesday, to Tuesday. What's the date today? I don't know. Anyways, busy all fucking week. Sunday finally will be able to. Anyways, how are you guys? I miss you guys a lot. I miss you guys a lot. I want to get back into live, but my mental health is not here right now to host a live for you guys. But I will be back. How are you?
My dumbass forgot the paper towel. But it's all good. Tomorrow I have to go out to a bunch of errands again anyway. Now I'm going to talk about for Carter. Carter's hungry. I'm going to talk about it on the oh, It's kind of warm today. It's humid. It's not hot, but it's humid. I keep sweating. What's your guys' favorite fast food click? Mine would probably be Popeyes, Popeyes, whatever, Popeyes. I'm excited because my city doesn't have one and they're finally building one now. It should be ready this time. something and I hate it. Looking for pants or shorts or whatever is the worst because my ass is too big for everything. <laughs> if it fits over then it doesn't fit my waist. It's too big or too small. If it fits over that means it's too big for my waist. But if it doesn't fit over my ass, that means it fits my waist. I hate it. But we'll see what we can find out. I might just give up and, or not give up, but I might just say fuck it and wear a skirt because those are very easy and like fit. But I hate dresses. Seven books in eight days. I've been reading a lot. I just ordered a new book today and it arrived today. Caught the um, the next door neighbor. I think it's about thirteen children. Couple had thirteen children and those thirteen kids were not allowed to leave the house ever. They didn't go to school, they couldn't play outside, they were held hostage in their own home. And I was reading the reviews and many people say it was a hard book to read. So, it's a true story. I don't remember what state though. I will have to read it, but I'll start reading it tonight. So, I also read another really good book I finished a few days ago um, called Behind Closed Doors. Behind Closed Doors. That book was my trip in. It was about a husband who's a lawyer, a lawyer, and he's a lawyer for domestic violence victim, and he went all his cases, blah, 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 and guess what, he is a horrible person, he's a murderer, he beat the shit out of his wife, and all this stuff, it's a really good book, I was actually like, <laughs> while <I'm> reading it, but <laughs> that was a good book, um, you guys have any book recommendations for me? Because I usually finish up one book in one day, two days, depending on what I'm doing, you know. So if you guys have a good, I love true stories, you know, like someone's experience, 
doesn't have to be crime related, murder related, murder related, no, but I mean, true story. Drop your recommendation below. I'm going to shut up now. I think I've been talking for like 15 minutes total. I'm going to talk about it and then I'm going home. So they did not have what I needed. So now I'm gonna go to AutoZone. AutoZone, I guess. I don't really like shopping there. I'm sweating. Oh. I guess I gotta AutoZone. AutoZone, I guess. Hopefully they have it. The funny part is auto auto zone is near my house. Flip farm is on the other side of town. The wait gas. <laughs> oh well that's power line. So I'm gonna go get the filter and the oil and pass I need a new light bulb for this thing can you see it yeah. so I'm gonna see if they have that too because you know that's what you do like every time it's night time you need a hair who goes somewhere we can't see each other so I'm gonna look for this So I finally got oil and oil filter. And the oil filter. But I wanted I wanted to change the light, but I can't find the light bulb that I took out. I can't find it. So fuck. But I'm gonna go home now. And see how old he just talks to me his home. It sucks because he has to go to bed in like one hour. Oh yeah. Okay, well I hope you enjoy watching me run around like my head cut off like a chicken. I'm I'm going I'm going to try to vlog tomorrow too. A lot of shit to do tomorrow. I have a lot of shit to do tomorrow. I'm getting my hair cut, oil change, my funeral clothes, all that shit. So maybe I'll bring it with. But look, I finally found it.
Home sweet home. Now I'm gonna wait for Harold to finish adding my vlog to his vlog and he's gonna go shower because he has to go to bed for work tomorrow. And then I'm gonna shower and then fold the basket of clothes. Ugh, whatever. <laughs> Anyways, I hope you enjoyed my vlog. See you guys tomorrow.